guys hope you're well uh, so I'm gonna do a summer themed candle haul for you today as you can tell by the title and I'm also gonna throw in before I get to it uh, a mini lush haul uh, so I'm gonna get cracking on that because I've actually got a lot of candles to show you <laughs> uh, so I'll quickly just show you what I got from lush uh, so I got I don't normally buy soaps from Lush because um, they do tend to be reasonably expensive and I don't know, I've just always mainly been obviously about the bath bombs and all about like the shower gels. I never really venture towards the soaps um, apart from one time at Christmas when they had like reindeer rock. Um, uh, but I thought I'd give Honey, I washed the kids soap a try. It basically looks like honey, smells like honey, smells incredible. And I was running low on soap, so I thought, you know what? I'll give this a go because it smells really nice and you can get the nice people that work there to chop off whatever amount you want, depending on how much you're willing to spend. So it was reasonable as well and very very helpful the staff are um so yeah and i'll show you what it looks like because it's gonna go in my bathroom anyway so i might as well unwrap it now <laughs> um so it kind of looks like that and like I said, smells of honey, smells really, really nice. So that's that one. And then there's some of these bath bombs have, not gonna lie, the weirdest names ever that I just can't pronounce. So I'm just gonna show you the name because I cannot for the life of me pronounce whatever that is. And I'll link the Lush site below so you can also read it there as well but whatever the name of this bath bomb is um i thought it was really really cute because to me it looked i think it's meant to be maybe a shell a seashell uh, which i thought was really really cool and again sticking to more or less kind of a springy summery themed it smells very, very citrusy, smells like lemon. So yeah, looks like that, very glittery. <laughs> I am gonna go through these quite quickly because I have a lot of candles, as I mentioned. And this one is the Blackberry Bath Bomb. And it pretty much is what it says on the tin. Looks like a blackberry. <laughs> and smells really, really cool. Smells different. Very fruity. <laughs> and this one is strawberries and cream bath bun. So a bit like with the blackberry one, it looks like a strawberry, which I thought was really cute. Again, smells smells very fruity, smells a little bit like strawberry. So there we go. That is pretty much the few little things that I got from Lush. And I also actually wanted to show you, um, so you know I am very into the Bayless and Harding um, soap dispenser because they do really, really cool scents. Uh, they, my regular go-to is I think the Apple Blossom and Jasmine one and then they did a limited edition cinnamon and mulled wine one which I had well they brought a limited edition summer one which is a called 
tropical cocktail and it smells amazing smells as you can imagine so tropical so fruity and i just love the packaging so yeah here we go definitely definitely check that out so yeah um no particular order of the candles i'm just gonna get to it so this one i've had before it's part of the yankee candle brand my fave um it's the vanilla lime so basically you get i think you get the smell of the lime and then it you get the sweet smell of the vanilla it smells so so cool and perfectly citrusy and fun for summer and then to go with the citrusy theme there is also the sicilian lemon which i've had before from yankee candle and looks like that there we go and there's also pink grapefruit from that i got from yankee candle if you didn't already guess so it looks like that <laughs> and just trying to see if there's any other citrusy ones um, I think that's all the citrusy ones for now um, there's I spent so long in the past trying to find this scent um, because there was one particular place that did it and it was only ever like a votive and then one year I think it was last year they decided to finally do it in webs which is where I mainly get the candles from either that or Clinton's um, and it's the village candle um, summer slices Juicy watermelon and refreshing cucumber. Oh my goodness, this smells incredible. And I spent so long up until last year trying to find where else I could get a watermelon scented candle. And yeah, I'm in love. <laughs> and the next one is red cherries now normally i'm a bit skeptical on cherry scented things or like cranberry scented things because they have a habit of smelling a bit perfumed and just a bit a bit much you know um but these are the closest things i have ever smelt to actual real cherries like they don't smell like the fake like sweet type cherries you know what i mean the ones you can get on top of like cherry bakewells that sort of thing i'm not about that life <laughs> um, but this smells exactly like real cherries so that's what the actual candle looks like so there we are red cherries and that is from the brand wax lyrical And then there's a couple of tropically themed candles. Um, so there's tropical coconut, which smells like coconut scented sun cream, which I love. It always makes me think of holidays. So that smells, like I said, like sun cream with a hint of coconut. And that, again, is from the Wax Lyrical brand. So there we go. Uh, again, I just love some of the packaging that they do. And this one, I think I got from HomeSense, I believe. And it's... I think they called it, what did they... 
uh, island retreat. So it's really weird because they don't put it like there, anywhere there. They put it like right at the bottom in the small print. Uh, so it's not that obvious what this candle is actually called, um, but it's called island retreat and it smells like pina colada so again a little bit a hint of coconut mainly pineapple so again very tropical very summery and the next one is wild mint and this is from again a yankee candle brand and it smells exactly like the mint that you would get in the garden it is the closest smell to the real thing so really really nice again very sort of fresh and summery lovely <laughs> And the next one, I tend to light nearer autumn, like sort of end of summer, early autumn. So kind of like late August, early September kind of thing. It's Campfire Marshmallow. And it's the Woodwick, Woodwick brand, which again is another brand I do quite like because I love how it crackles and I have already used this from last year. Some of these candles I've shown you I did actually use a little bit of last year and they've still managed to last me this year and probably will even last me till next year with the amount that I've of new ones that I've also got. There's no way that these are gonna last um, me just this summer which is good because it kind of makes the money worth it really. Um, and this is Rainbow Cookie. To me, it smells like basically like icing, like sherbetty icing. Uh, so again, quite summery and, you know, rainbows and all that. I think they actually released it one year as part of a Valentine's range for some reason, but I just thought personally it's quite summery in my opinion. <laughs> And I believe I've just got two more to show you. <laughs> um, and this one, again, I tend to like more closer to the autumn time, late summer time, because um, it's just got that kind of vibe, because this one smells quite musky, um, and it's Midsummer's Night. So it smells musky, but a little bit fruity it does smell really nice and actually almost aftershavey <laughs> so yeah again Yankee Candle Midsummer's Night and again love the picture love the packaging <laughs> and the last one is actually a Bayless and Harding one uh, it's called Love and it's Rose Prosecco and again, normally with scents like this, the actual thing doesn't smell like the real thing, if that makes sense. The candle doesn't normally quite smell like what it says, but this is the closest I've ever smelt to actual Prosecco. Like if I sniffed a glass of Prosecco, this would be the closest thing to that. It smells so, so nice. So yeah, Rose Prosecco, called Love from Bayliss and Harding. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that's all of the candles, um, as if that wasn't a lot. <laughs> um, but anyway, hope you enjoyed this video and I will hopefully see you soon with another one. If you liked it, you know what to do, give it a like and subscribe and I'll see you soon with another one. I hope you enjoy the weekend, especially if you're on bank holiday and love you lots. Bye. <laughs>